Welcome everyone. Thank you so much for coming out today to watch the Medical City Puppeteers. We hope that you learn something new and help us to spread the word about the signs of a stroke. We want you to be a stroke hero. Hey Sonia, that spelling test was hard today. How do you think you did? Well, I studied really hard. My grandma quizzed me all night when I got home yesterday. I think I did okay. I don't really want to think about it right now. At least it's over. Let's go find my grandma. She said that she would have a special snack waiting for us when we came home today. There's my favorite girl. How'd the test go? We find out tomorrow. Thanks for quizzing me last night. I think it really helped. I'm going to ask my dad to quiz me before our next test. I guess that's the secret. It sure helps to study. Have a snack so you guys can start on your homework with some energy. Thanks, Grandma. Grandma? Are you okay? You don't look right. I don't feel right. I don't know what it is. My arms feel funny, and my tongue feels really heavy. What do we do? S something's not right. I learned about this in school last year. I think she's having a stroke. Let's call the stroke hero. I need a superhero. Yeah! Hello, young lady. I hear you are looking for a hero. I am the person that you need. You're the stroke hero. Great. Something's wrong with my grandma. Yeah, what do we do? Oh my, something is definitely wrong. I'll do a simple check to see what the problem is. Fast. F is for face. I look at her face. Is it falling down on one side? Yes, her mouth is drooping down. A is for arms. Can she hold up both arms? Hmm, it looks like one falls right down. S is for speech. Does she sound strange? <laughs> yes, definitely strange. T is for time. This is the most important one. It's time to call 911. We need to bring in the other stroke heroes. Let's do it together. Fast. F, F is for face. Is, is it falling down, down on one side? A is for arms. Can you hold up both arms? S is for speech. Does the person sound strange? T is for time. Time to call 911. I'm calling 911 right now. Hi, I heard there's an emergency. What's going on? Sonia's grandma is having a stroke. She needs help fast. Oh, I can definitely see she's having signs of a stroke. Look at her face right there. And look at her arms. See how they're drooping? Ma'am, what's your name? Can you tell me your name? <laughs> okay, her speech sounds really strange. We need to get her to the hospital right away. When did this start? When was she normal? It just started five minutes ago. We were talking to her when everything started. One last question. Do you have a phone number I can reach your mom or dad? Yes, here it is. We keep it on the refrigerator along with a list of her medicine. Great job, Stroke Heroes. You recognize the signs of a stroke fast. Two weeks later. <laughs> Grandma, you're home. You sure do look better than the last time I saw you. You're telling me I sure do feel better. The doctor said I had a stroke. A stroke? I know what one looks like, but what is it? A stroke happens in the brain when it stops working the way it should. It is kind of like when you close off a water hose. What does that have to do with your brain? Blood goes into the brain to help us think and move. If it gets blocked like a water hose, the doctors and nurses will give a special medicine that opens up the hose. I bet there is someone that can show us a little bit about water. Oh, Ellie! Hi there, how can I help? I am trying to explain what happens during a stroke. Can you help? Sure. I use my trunk to bring in water when I want to drink or just cool off. If my trunk gets blocked, then I can't bring up the water. That's what happens during a stroke. The blood gets blocked. The medicine helps blood flow again, just like my trunk. Before you know it, everything works again. I get it. They unkinked the hose. You guessed it. Once I received the medicine, I could move and talk again. Now I feel great. Oh, Stroke Heroes. Thank you, Stroke Heroes. You saved my life. 
I'm so lucky that you called 911 and knew the signs of a stroke. Do you know the signs? Let's review it together one more time. Would everyone in the room please help us? Fast. F, F is for face. Is, is it falling down on one side? A is for arms. Can you hold up both arms? S is for speech. Does the person sound strange? T is for time. Time to call 911. You can be a stroke hero too. Don't forget, you can be a stroke hero too by recognizing the signs and calling 911. Thanks. Be a superhero.